Alright everybody, welcome back to Crimea Elf Adventure, and uh, last time, Gail met Raphael, yes, we met Raphael in the Goblin Stronghold, so here's the thing, I don't know if I should accept Raphael's uh, deal, slash proposal, or not, uh, what I do know though, is that I am unable to enter that burrow hole that is in this room. Right about there. This rocky crevice. Which I believe is an entrance to the Underdark. Because of the Saluna. Uh, what this is. I don't know what's it called, what it's called, but the symbols on the wall are the symbols from uh, is that blood? Saluna. No, never mind. Even though it's... it's they, they write it as Salune. Saloon. You would think that's how you pronounce it. Saloon. It's S-E-L-U-N-E. -E. Saloony? <laughs> they pronounce it as Saluna for some reason. It's a little bit weird. Alright. Uh, in this video, we might be doing a little bit, uh, a little bit of a weird uh, mix. Let's see how many people we got in the party. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We are missing one. We are missing one. I repeat, we are missing one. So let me go see if I can talk to Halsin real quick. Maybe convince him to come with us. Let me see if Mintora woke up. Just randomly, accidentally, and forgot that she was a true soul. <laughs> and after that, I have a plan, okay? I have a plan. It's something... Something a little bit weird, okay? Something that I've... I don't usually do in games like this. I'm gonna split the party up. I'm gonna split the party up. Now, I will do this in a way in which is a little bit weird because uh, I have an uneven number. But, but, here's what we do. Um, first of all, we gotta smack these. For some reason I cannot move past these doors without actually clicking on them. We, we gotta click it on them. Why is pass interrupted? Hello? Am I seriously being attacked through doors which are open but I can't attack through them? What? Confusion? Hello? Okay, how do I... Bro, this is annoying. What is happening? Alright, can I please move through the door preferably? Random instance, kinda. I can dash again, but, uh, you know what, it don't matter. A Starion can tank this solo anyway. It's fine. Yeah, baby. We tank those. All right, Gale, can you hit from here? Uh, that's a yes and a no at the same time. Oh my god. Okay. Bro, what is wrong with these doors? Like... Actually stupid, hold up. Okay. Do I do the chromatic orb actually? For once. Let's see. Sure, let me do some acid. Can I hit you both? Uh, but I'm gonna hit the stereo as well with this... With this circle, we do not want to hit Asterion as well. I may accidentally kill him. Um, Trinzas, you going down? Or not? I can't even catch my breath. All right. This is very annoying. I'm sorry, but how, how is my path being interrupted by, by open doors, bro? What is going on? 
It's actually stupid annoying. You don't even know. Okay, there's another dude up there. Of course, Gale gets destroyed as per usual. I gotta do something about that. It's getting annoying. Alright. Karlak, we going in. Uh, let's actually piercing shot. Uh, never mind. All right, we hit him. Nice. We hit him too. Nice. Uh, by the way, I noticed that in the last video I said the shadow spawn lasts forever. Um, I was wrong. I noticed after I ended the video. The Wraith slash Shadow Spawn does in fact have a, a a turn timer. I believe it to be around 600 turns. Something along those lines. What should I do? What you should do is you should try to go past the barrier that is these open doors. That's what you should do. <laughs> oh my god. They can't shoot, bro. What is up with these doors? This has got to be like the most annoying shit I've ever seen. Just random doors that just do not allow you to hit through them. For some reason. I believe these doors are... Supposed to be closed, and for for whatever reason, they are open now, and you can't attack through them. It's, it's very weird. It's very weird. Okay. Switch back to melee. Danke. Alright, we got another dude in here. We gotta smack him real quick. Boom. Okay. Make it count. There is another goblin somewhere. Oh. Oh. Oh, that's a nice crit, though. Too bad it's not a one-shot. Anyway. Yeah, let's, let's not hellish rebuke for a 2 HP goblin. Oh my god, Karlak, hit him, bro. <laughs> Sister, rather. Come on. Fuck yes. Hit him. Let's go. Oh, there's another one. How many? Wait, two more. Oh, there's one over there as well. Huh. Cute angle through the wall, though. No holding back. Girl is trying to wall bang the dude. For some reason. Uh, this is my time. No time to waste. All right. Can you hit? Nice double hit. I'll take it. Too bad I don't got a crossbow or something. Alright. These doors are the biggest difficulty jump I've ever had in the game so far. <laughs> uh, funny. Alright, I need to make Gale on there. I need to import death on Gale. He's getting annoying. I should probably do that to Astarion as well, hmm. Just in case he randomly dies so he can revive, because... Vampire. Oh, that's just barely out of range! Damn it, man! Okay. Can I sneak attack? No. Okay. Sure. I'll take it. Um, Gale can just sit here in the back. It's fine. I don't think I got an angle with Kremiel from nowhere. But I will try to hit from over here. I don't think it's possible, question mark? 
Can't reach destination. Yeah, no. Nah. Unless I'm not clicking on the right thing. Hold up. Not enough movement. No, we got no angle. Okay. End. Well, Will just got destroyed. Rip William. Okay, surely I can... Is it extra attack, not extra action? It's extra attack. Damn it! Okay. It's a little bit annoying that that is the case, but it's fine. Can you please just shoot? What? I'm sorry, what? I just hit air and it did no damage. You know what I should have done? Gone up with uh, Shadowheart and tried to rescue Will. Try to use that one, which I end up never using. Why can't I hit you from here? What the fuck? Never mind. I will, ascend. will you, though? Can you jump? Yes. Alright, please hit this one. God, the camera angles are so bad. Holy. Imagine having to play this without uh, native camera tweaks. Jesus. Yeah, the one thing they really fucked up in this game is the camera angles. Holy. Oh, yeah, yeah. I think that's my only legit complaint about the game. Some of these camera angles are abysmal. Like, actually, no joke. Even with native camera tweaks, it's still bad, bro. Alright, what the fuck does this do? It stabilizes the downed person? Question mark? I would assume. There's a chest there. Okay, never mind, we got nothing. Alright. Time to go down. I kinda need to heal my party. I have one more short rest. And uh, I do have catnaps for everybody, I believe. I think I will use catnap. Alright. Gail? Time to catnap everybody. Let's see. I'm a catnap Kremiel, catnap Lazel, and Will definitely needs it. Uh, invalid target because he already received it apparently. Alright. Ah, yes. Good old wild magic surge, baby. With a sheep. Okay. Um, uh, sure. This is good. I don't really got much of a choice. I don't want to use the short rest just yet. Well, Alright. So what I was saying is that I am gonna touch Gale real quick with import on death. Alright. Ominous... Important Otherworld Invocation. Okay, and uh, let's see. So, here's the party. I'm gonna take Shadowheart and Gale with Kremiel to the Otherworld. Or rather, the Underdark. And then uh, Lazel's gonna take Astarion, Karlak and Will. To the Githyanki. Sound good? Yes. That sounds like a plan to me. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna split the party up. Oh, I might have just gone and fucked up hor horribly. <laughs> I might have just gone and fucked up horribly. It's fine. 
It's fine. I completely forgot there's a big fat ogre and the full party of gobbles at the entrance. I got him fucked up, but I do need the levels, so bear with me real quick. Okay. Let's see now. I do believe it's time I mark of the fallen. And I'll try to pommel the good old Gurgon. Gur 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 good old Gurgon. Gurgon. Yes. Please don't do AoE. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> I am becoming uh, more used to pain, apparently. Sure, sure. Alright, Karlak, you're going to melee. Say bye -bye. Yeah! Get him! What? Game? You good? I was gonna say. <laughs> Alright, Karlak's got this solo. Okay. Not okay. No, don't heal Gorgon. <laughs> oh, that's bad. No, Gale. Uh, okay, he revives next turn, though. He is undead now. I hope, at least. He is, uh... Let's see, is he on there? I did touch him with import on death. He is, okay. So he does, or rather should, revive next turn. So I'm not gonna bother reviving him all the damn time. You can self-revive all you want from now on. I'm tired of having to revive Gale all, all the freaking time. If I hit him... Will he still be fearful? Can't take any additional actions. Uh, I'm assuming this is not gonna break fear. So let me hit, but before I hit... I believe it's time I use magic weapon. Or do I go with elemental weapon? Hmm. This is a level 3. This is a level 2. Um, I will uh, not waste my level 3 spell slot. Let's see. Level 1, level 2. I already have AoE aid. I could have you metal the ogre. You know what? I think that might actually be the play. Let me just... Oh, it's not metal. Oh. Yikes. I'm tempted to just Spirit Guardian and run into the fray. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, I don't want to use the level 3 spell slot because I may need Warden of Vitality. I'm not exactly sure how it works, but... I don't really need the level 2 spell slot. So I'll just do this. Okay. Please jump there. Alright, let's... No, what are you doing? I clicked on him, not behind him. What the fuck, Lazel? <laughs> Random. Random much? I'm sorry, can't you just jump from where I tell you to jump, please? Okay, let me, let me sneak attack the guy. And the next time, I should probably try to disarm Gurgon. Gurgon, the destroyer. Ah. We got... Is Crusher a Beastmaster? Was he the guy that summoned the, the, the thing? What a fudge. Oh my god, these angles, bro. I can't see properly. No, Crusher was not the one. Who the 
Fudge summoned the, the thing. The tracker? Where are you at? Who summoned the warg? Will it tell me if I check? It's not showing me anybody that actually has a spell on them or a concentration spell, rather. Who the fuck summoned this warg, brother? Has to be one of the trackers. I'm gonna assume it's Sharp Eye Berg or Kirz. <laughs> These names, bro. Uh, I think I just need to summon Shadow Spawn at this point, but it's gonna despawn by the time I reach the git, so. Let's not do that, maybe? Two steps at a time. Okay, can you. Can you hit? Can, can you hit? Oh my god! Bro, okay, who is you? I, I can't... C I... Uh, huh? Okay. Jesus! Okay. Oh my god, that was so annoying. Alright, Karlak is getting, uh... Ooh, she, she's tanking some damage. She is tanking some damage. I don't like this. Uh, I do have a lot of heals. But at the same time, I don't really want to use them. Do I have a greater healing potion? Is there a way to more easily check inventory? Yes. Okay. I'm gonna use one of this. Okay. And... Uh, this just went off. Because... Guy got feared. We'll see now. I basically got no actions because I just healed. I'm gonna just have to hit this. You know what? It's time. Motherfucker, it's time for Wraith Form. What do I do in Wraith Form, though? <laughs> resistant to non-magic damage. Does, what does resistance mean, though? Only take half. Okay. Gain advantage on basically everything that's melee. And basically everything that's physical. Can't attack, cast spells, or talk. Okay, I'm just gonna sit in Wraith form because I don't think... Kremiel can 1v1 this monstrosity of a warg... With such low HP. I actually don't think Kremiel can one of you on that. And it, she's gonna die in two turns. And unless I raid for him to reduce the damage. Oh my god, why are you command halting Karlak nonstop, bro? Karlak's getting destroyed. Oh my god, Karlak is getting destroyed. At least she's tanking like 20 fucking hits before she goes down. I I need Karlak to just start hitting somehow. Um Okay, let's see. I I can move because the blindness thing is here. So that means I'm not gonna provoke 
an attack of opportunity. That means I can get right up in Karlak's face and hopefully help her. Motherfucker, what? I'm sorry, what? The fuck was that? Okay, that may be bad. That, that may be real bad. Okay, I I will... But if I do this, I'm gonna break my concentration on magic weapon. But I feel like I, did, I just need to AoE these suckers. I really feel like it. I, I kind of have to do it. Let's see, is there a way to more easily handle this? I don't think there is. I think this is Shadow Heart's time to shine. Unless I wake up... Uh... This motherfucker's gonna halt uh, Karlak again. How many times can you cast that? <laughs> Surely it's like three to four times tops, no? But if she's halted next turn as well, she's dead. I can't stabilize her with Spirit of Dying. Do I Warden of Vitality? I don't exactly know how many times I can restore Vitality within 10 turns. I'm gonna assume this is only once, and if I cast this, this also being an action... Uh, I already used my bonus action because I jumped... Both Shadowheart and Karlak are gonna die. So I feel like I have the Spirit Guardian here. If I don't do this, I lose them both. Uh, it's so annoying. I have Aura of the Forge. But at the same time, this is much stronger. And this is almost guaranteed that somebody may die. What is stronger for these? Necrotic or Radiant? Do they have any sort of resistance? No? Cleric boost? They are clerics, apparently. Or rather, have a cleric boost. No resistance. Sure, I'll just... I'll just do necrotic, I guess. Yeah, I'll break magic weapon, but at least I may be able to... Will this also hit Karlak? It's fine. Damn, that looks kind of cool, actually. Okay, they're gonna take a bunch of damage. They're probably gonna start hitting Shadow Hard, but it's fine. At least Shadow Hard's done her part. I need to get rid of Bowie Knook, my bugbeer guy. He needs to go. So I can start dealing with the fucking ogre. Uh, Alright, come on, I got two more. I'll lacerate. Good. Hit him again. Never mind. Well, at least he's bleeding. Of course, a starter misses for whatever reason. Uh, please sneak attack him. Actually, let's poison. It's a 3d6, but I don't think he's gonna die. No, you know what? Let's disarm. I feel like disarm might just be better. Alright, and I need to start out to just run through blood towards Ogre. Okay, he heals a little bit of HP. In the process... I'm gonna have to deal with the good old ogre somehow. Also killed the motherfucker that summoned the warg. I think it's Crusher, actually. Or was it the Booyag from upstairs? Wait, this is the dude with the book. Of course he's gonna start casting random shit from above. 
Uh, okay, Will. I'm sorry, what? Oh my god. Can you just teleport upstairs, motherfucker? Holy! Yeah, the camera angles are absolutely abysmal, bro. Why do I have to go here so I can teleport there? It's out of sight. <sighs> yeah, there is some stuff that is very cringe. Okay, it's time for the shadow spawn. It really is, because there's a bunch of fucking goblins in here. Yeah, so it's 600 turns. I just didn't notice it at first. Yeah, I'll just summon the, the one with fury. Uh, let me put it here. Let me go hit the tracker real quick. Nice. And can I move without getting hit? Good. Very good. Okay. Thankfully, we have the Levi... Levi, Levi <coughs> the Basking in Leviathan's Love, or Leviathar, or however you want to pronounce that god's name, which I believe reduces our damage taken yes it does in fact reduce the damage we we take because we become more resistant to pain when we have that apparently we have resistance to almost everything we might just have resistance to everything in the game at this point I think now, I, bear in mind that I cannot hit, but I can keep the warg here for a little bit. Which I will do. Sheesh! Good old Gurgon kind of hitting hard. Hold up. Alright, he's out of the Spirit Guardian, which is kind of annoying, but I'm hoping they still die. If you cast hold one more time... Oh my god, what the fucking... Okay, at least Karlax... Never mind, Karlak is dying. <laughs> I think I... Please don't... Please don't lose concentration. I did give her the boots, no? Please tell me I gave uh, Shadowheart the boots. Oh my god, my party's dying. Okay, thank fuck Shadowheart, you're being useful for once. Yes, that's what I like to see, baby. Alright, we're doing the mall. Okay, can I still pick her up? I can. Nice. Very cool. Very cool. For once, Shadowheart is not the, the useless one in the party. <laughs> okay, I have to move carefully so I don't get hit. Let's go, baby! If you're wondering why I did that, it's because that shit hits every single time anybody enters, I'm pretty sure. So I can basically hit anybody on the move, okay? I technically don't have to melee hit anybody because they're gonna get hit instantly in the zone by the spirits. That is such a cool ability. Still at disadvantage because of the smoke. I kinda just need to do this. Please don't get hit. Thank you. Okay. I think I got a tears protection here. I may have to just full rest after this because I did not want to do this. Uh, I think I do this on a Starion actually. I'll just shield the fate. And 
I kind of need to cover good old Bugbeer over here. Make sure I'm not blind when I do it. Okay, now Astarion has to bloodlet. He can bloodlet himself to heal himself, though. But at the same time, I could just run through blood. So let me not waste the, the blood. I'm sorry, am I not healing? Am I not healing because I'm not seeing the blood? What? Blind OP. <laughs> okay. Yeah, let me let me use the blind. I will run through the blur. I need to pick Gale up for some fucking reason. He doesn't want to revive. Ah. <sighs> Why is Gale not reviving, bro? Okay. Oh, outside of combat! I was really hoping that is not the case, but it's fine. It kinda hurts though. Hmm. Darn thing is already being useful. It only tanked one hit, but it's enough. I'm sorry, how do I not have action? Okay, we are entering rage mode. I wish I could heal, but I can't. I can't. I'm gonna have to just pull Karlak out of the way. I'm gonna force them to walk through Shadow Heart's thing. And I think I just go mark this guy. If you're wondering why I'm saying mark, uh, Blood Bowl. <laughs> if you don't know what Blood Bowl is, it's a. Uh, Basically, rugby game, I think. Or is it soccer? Uh, not soccer, it's football. American football. Soccer is the other one you do with your leg. <laughs> wondering why I said uh, soccer first. <laughs> um, we use football for soccer in Romania. And we call the football, where you, you're you playing basically rugby, we call that uh, American football in Romania, okay? It's a little bit different for us. Alright, um, I think I just need Shadowheart to move through. But before I do that, can I heal and still move? I don't have the long range heal unless I want to do the aid. I may have just removed that. Alright, here's what I'm gonna do. If I throw, that's gonna be an action. If I move, that's... Is moving an action? Is moving considered action? I don't think moving is considered action. So I'm gonna throw a... Never mind, I don't have a potion. Damn it, man. <laughs> okay. It is what it is. Alright, I just need to go and mark those people. Alright, let's test my theory of moving spirits into... Yup, okay. That is in fact the case, but unfortunately now I can't move from here. Okay, Bugbeard down. I need to get rid of the ranged. So I can go start dealing with the melee people. There we go, there we go. Alright. 
Wake up, Gale. I am sitting in fire. That's not good. Okay, how am I not healing, though? I may need to sanguinary projection myself. So I am immune to flame. A tale for the ages. I do need to move Gale from this spot because it's kind of annoying. Is there a way to make Gale safe? I do recall some sleeping uh, goblins up there. Is there anybody in that direction? I don't think there is, so technically, this is the safest spot for Gale. Alright. Of course. I'm hoping nobody can reach all the way over here. So he at least stays alive to dish some damage from a distance. Of course you're gonna miss. Oh my god, Karlak is getting destroyed in this uh in this fight. This accidental fight I started. Okay, can you do something, no? Ga really? Are you hitting Gale? Okay. Kremiel is tanking like a champ. You're gonna have to continue doing that for the fucking warg. Oi, oi, oi. She's definitely going after Gale. What the fuck are you doing, bro? Went upstairs, went back down. Okay. Uh, we shield. Everybody is dying, bro. Okay, Shadowheart, I need you to start healing people or killing people. I didn't think Shadowheart would be the main character. Let's start dealing with two. There we go. Unfortunately, they're not dead. And I don't have another AoE. So... Let's just hit this one. Because he may run away. Okay. Um... We'll see now. I think I... Tasha's hideous laughter. But this is gonna break Astarion's thing. And I do need to hold him strong for the ogre battle. I need Karlak up. Like now. Please start hitting and healing yourself. Speaking of healing. Time to second wind. There we go. That's a nice heal. That's almost full. I need to go mark this guy. Um, we'll see now. This fucking Booyag or whatever is gonna start doing something. So I'll teleport Gale right in front. Oh, for fuck's sake, I forgot. Yeah. Okay, there, uh, there's a lot of people up there. I'm just gonna do this. Okay. Heal creatures, you say? For how many turns? Five turns. Oh. I have AoE heals for five turns. Where's this Booyag? Oh, it's right there. Oh, that's actually kind of bad. Because he can hit me. Not good. Oh my god, Karlak is getting destroyed and this fella is just moving in front of Lazel. <laughs> uh. Karlak literally can't do anything and we'll just die. Damn it, man. The fucking shadow spawn was useless too. Okay, how many turns? I got seven turns of Spirit Guardian left. <sighs> Rough fight, bro. Rough fight. Okay. We miss. Good. Good. I can't do anything. Oh my god. Well, that just broke Spirit Guardian. My entire party is getting wiped.
That gotta be the guy. Okay. Can I miss this step without taking attack of opportunity? I'm gonna assume that I can. I'm here hoping I'm right. Good. Now I, I kinda need to just be close to Karlak. Attempt to rescue Karlak next turn. Attempt to make her, well, useful. But I could just do this. Man, come on. Bro, Stadion, come on, what are you doing? I can't jump there because Lazel's in the way. That's so bad. I'll just do this. I can't... That is cringe. It doesn't say that this uses an action. Even though it does say it's a class action. If I bloodlet, invalid target. Oh, fuck off, bro. Alright, I have to bloodlet... Let's see, I think I have to just bloodlet myself. Okay, I got nothing. Right, you are moving up front. Alright, Gail, I need you to be actually useful. And I think the only way I can make Gale proper useful is by saving Shadowheart. Keep in mind, I technically heal people. Okay, I technically heal people. The only problem is gonna be that I may just kill off Shadowheart accidentally. But it's fine. Okay, I will do this. Please heal Shadowheart. Okay, that's not healing. I could grease. It's a dex save. Guy got 12 dex. This tracker got 16 dex. That's kind of bad. The the ogre may fall though. Well, that's a fucking risky move right there. Or I could do this. Could 53. But it's also probably gonna kill Shadowheart. I don't really want that. But at the same time, Shadowheart is gonna be revived by the one heal, I believe. You know what I need to do? I need to just import on death to Shadowheart at this point. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna Ice Knife. We are a little bit at a disadvantage. I'm hoping she doesn't die. I'm hoping she just gets put down in do uh, the down state again. Okay, she revived with a lot of HP. What the fuck? I I'm gonna take it, but what? How did I heal Shadowheart so, so much? Also, damn, that's a lot of damage. What is up with this fire? What? How did I f wait? Oh, okay. Wild damage burning. Interesting. I'm gonna keep Gale here. And I'm gonna keep using spells from near Shadowheart so I can heal Shadowheart. It's gonna be interesting. This is gonna be. Interesting. I think I gotta... No, if I do this, she's gonna start hitting Shadowheart for no fucking reason. But it's fine. Do I have a heal? No. Damn it, man. 
Okay, Shadow Heart with the Aura Forge should just gain fire immunity. But she doesn't. Can I do this? No. I I literally can't do anything right now. It pains me to say it, but useless. I need to kill these. Are you fucking kidding me? Bro. That's all Gale's fault, by the way. <laughs> he the one who woke him up when I teleported his ass. Oh my god. Okay, thank god for that. I think I just need to save Kremiel somehow. Oh my god. Bro. Um, no scroll of revify or whatever it's called, no revivals. Okay, you are healing. Um, I can't heal. Oh, I can't use actions in wraith form. That is so cringe. I'm gonna cause an attack of opportunity as well. Can I dash? I, I can't dash because it's an action. Such cringe! I just gotta sit there and take it, bro. Actually, kinda works with Wraith form <laughs> that I got Leviathan's Blessing. Oh my god. This is a total, total failure! This entire fight is a total fucking failure! <laughs> uh, I'm gonna have to restart. I'm gonna have to restart. I don't want to have to restart. <sighs> this fucking guy, bro. He's the... F he's the whole reason as to why this is going so poorly. Fuck you. I wish I had a heal. I really just wish I had a fucking heal. <sighs> no, please don't die. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, this is the, the, the fucking Git Yankee all over again. No. <laughs> Kremiel's the only one alive. <laughs> and not for long. I need to exit shadow form somehow. And somehow help people. Oh no, it's another fucking war! <laughs> oh no! Okay. Okay. Um. 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 Please don't die! Time to press ahead. Shit! <laughs> I don't think I can get out of shadow form. How do I... How do I exit shadow form, by the way? How do I exit shadow form? It says you may exit this form at any time. Light will dispel. Was I not sitting in a light? I'm confused. Yeah, okay, I got majorly fucked up, brother. I can't do anything, even in shadow, f in raid form. Oh my god, this is this is sad, bro. Uh, one thing I did notice. Is that this does not say that I lose concentration. So technically, if I grab a concentration spell that is AoE, does damage around me, I may be able to maintain concentration spell? You never know. It doesn't say that I, it says that I can't cast or attack or talk, does not say or, or, or use action, but it doesn't say that I cannot. Maintain concentration spells. So, maybe? 
Okay, uh, I will have to restart. This was a total fuck up on my part. What I should have done is just teleported outside. <laughs> but I accidentally went outside and started a whole new fucking unwinnable battle. It might have been winnable, but played in a different way. Um, yeah, this guy right here, this dude is the sole fucking reason as to why I lost this. This guy and the fucking work that was marking Kremiel all the damn time. If this guy didn't kill Karlak like three to four times, maybe I would have won this. Because Shadowheart was pulling hard. She was pulling her nuts across everybody's faces. Alright, that was out of pocket, but it's fine. Uh, I, I do need to just go back. I do need to just go back. This was a total fuck up on my part. And it resulted in a full wipe. <laughs> in a full wipe, bro. Eight, seven people. Ay, ay, ay. Also, Gale died early, which is bad. So, there is that. Yeah. We have to load. Ah, full hour wasted. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. Absolute fuck up, brother. Oh my god. That was actually sad. Oh, I'm inside the battle on this one. Uh, you know what? I will take this battle, actually. Because I do need to redo. Because that was bullshit what I just did accidentally. I don't have a advantage. I up. Yep, okay. All just ranged. Okay. I don't fancy their chances. Um. Sure. Let's just leave him here. Or I'll go here rather. And turn. And we don't technically care. Yeah, we'll we'll does die here. Just kill off the goblins real quick. Ay ay ay. Okay. No more... Can't climb? Why? No more action? Can you jump? Nope. Okay. Victory awaits. How is this not enough movement? That was a little bit weird. But it's fine. Okay. Okay, can we, we please wake up Will? Alright. Now, what I should have done... Is... Teleported... Outside, instead of starting the fight, or... Do I really want to just do this? Oh my god, this may be bad, but... I, I may just start the fight with the goblins again, just in a different way. This may be bad, though. Keep that in mind. It may still end up poorly in my... Uh, or rather, not in my favor. Okay. I didn't think I would still have to deal with the goblins, but it is experience that is going towards my next level. And we do need a bunch of EXP if we want to level up. Okay, let's go touch this ladder real quick. I don't remember a broken wall. I just need to find it from this side. Okay, so I'm gonna start killing them off from upstairs. Where is 
There's the collapsed corridor. No getting through. More the pity. No? Not allowed? Why though? This is a little bit sad. No getting through. More's the pity. Bro, I found the wall from this side, but it's not letting me use it. That's kind of sad. Actually kind of sad cuz I was going to fight them, but I was going to fight them, but it's not letting me use the wall. I'm pretty sure this is where you end up if you break the wall from the outside. Um, this is where Gale woke up the the bugbears, the the drunks, the drunk dudes upstairs. There was a cracked wall. You can open it, but apparently only from the other side. That is so sad. Well, I guess I'm gonna have to TP. Hmm. I will. If I teleport to Goblin Camp... Wait. Hold up. I still want to kill them. I still want to kill them, because it's experience that I am losing if I'm not killing them. At the ready. I still want to kill them, so I will attempt that before I split the party up. Have I not clicked on Kremiel? What? A little bit of confusion. Okay. We are... Trying to find the way... Oh, I need to go down. Wrong way. Hold up. This place is still a little bit confusing. Oh my god. Yeah, Gale, Gale is still the play. I need to teleport with Gale. It's so much easier to travel when I can just teleport around. Oh, potion. Could be useful. Guy ran off, by the way. Alright. This is where the torturer was that gave Kremiel a beating. <laughs> You would only know about this if you've watched the other video. Alright, we use the passageway. Okay. Let me teleport upstairs. Alright, so we got these people which are drunk. I'm gonna fireball the fuck out of them. They are not dead, but it's fine. I'm gonna move away a little bit. Oh, they, they can still hit me though. I am pretty sure. Let me just move all the way in the back. It's fine. Okay. So I think it's time to embrace of the fallen. I may just use Shadow Blade. They're both bonus actions though. Oh, that's kind of cringe. Do I have an AoE that I do not know about? I do not. So I can't use Shadow Blade and Wraith Form. Okay, I'm gonna Embrace of the Fallen. Come on. Come on. Okay, then we move this here. I will take flight. And for some reason I don't have enough move speed to actually go all the way there. 
the gods are watching me. Bro, look at how far it's telling me that I can go, but it's telling me that I do not have enough move speed. It doesn't say that I need a certain move speed to fly. Why can't I do it, brother? Let me just get there. Oh my god. Watch Kremiel just accidentally die. Did I not end turn on Gale? I may have not. Okay, I think I should have... Also, it's not path interrupted for this one, but it's interrupted for the sneak attack. Of course, that makes sense, no? <laughs> Alright, hit him. Bro. A starry on my guy. Okay, it's fine. Okay, what is the maximum amount of running you can do? I think this is it. I can't reach destination for whatever reason, even though I can still run a little bit. It's telling me no. Alright. I need to kill these off fast before they wake the other dudes up. This is the way to do it. Can what is this camera angle? Hello? What is this camera? I can't see shit, bro. We're randomly zooming in. Okay, I don't think I need to be in melee. It says 18 meters, so thank god for that. I'll do this for Kremiel. We are shield of fading her. And we currently have... Still breathing. Everything. 20 AC. Shield of Fate, Defense, Dexterity, and the Armor. I don't have the Forge? No Forge? I will ascend. Okay, they're afraid. It's fine. It's fine. I need Karlak to run. Just kind of get in range. Will you please move though? Okay, hit him. This camera angle is actually killing me. Hit him again. Okay, he dies next turn to flame. Uh, never mind, he's not on fire anymore. For some reason. It's fine. Okay, please look. Bro! Okay, it's fine. Okay, they woke up. That's not fine. Please don't... Randomly wake up everybody. Ay, ay, ay. Okay, there is fog, which is kind of cringe, but I'll accept it for now. No time to waste. Man, come on. Just hit him, bro. Okay. I had to make sure I actually hit. Alright. Shadow Horde, I need you to dash. Go as far as you can go. And I think this might just be it, because they're blocking the road. Okay, never mind. Why am I being shown the ground all the damn time, game? Alright, Gale, do your thing. I need you to bust some goblins real quick. See, this is the cracked wall I was telling you about. This is the one from the other side, which I cannot access, because I didn't break it from this side. Why is it not breakable from both sides is beyond my comprehension. I'll bust the wall, though, because I kind of just want to bust it. Let's see, that's a tracker. Those trackers are absolute cringe, by the way. Let me flame these. Yeah, that spell is brokey. Loki brokey, especially on Gale. Since he can cast multiple times. Uh, 
Alright, I need to jump over fire. So I don't accidentally flame myself. Can you hit from here? Not really. Why is path interrupted? It's technically not. Technically not interrupted, but... Yep, I did get an angle. It's a little bit of a bad angle, but it's still an angle. It, if it works, don't question it. I need to deal with this dude upstairs. Which is also kind of annoying to have to deal with. Not enough move speed because he's really far away. Okay, it's fine. Can I hit the guy from here with Lazelle? No. Uh, let's see now. I have... Okay, so this is 10 turns. Embrace of the Fallen Aura. See, it doesn't say... Because if you check here, it says that Embrace of the Fallen is permanent. Okay? It's really, really weird. Because it says permanent, but it only lasts 10 turns. That is very weird. That is extremely fucking weird to me. That it says that. And everybody just started a fight with Kremiel. Okay. I have 10 turns of Shadow Blade. And I think I may just use it. Nah. Is the Shadow Blade better? That is my question. Is it better than my my normal greatsword? It's still a 16. It's technically not the better. When you use the sword to attack a target that is in dim light or darkness, you make the attack roll with advantage. Okay, technically better. Because of that. Alright, we use we're using the Shadow Blade. And we are dashing. I need to start killing off the Booyag. Let's be on my way. Can I still fly? Uh, the answer is no. Because I don't have enough move speed. I need to kill off the Booyag and fast. I also need to heal Kremiel. And fast. I could just literally jump Karlak all the way down. I could end up prone though. It's very bad. So let's not do that. I do have height advantage. I can't see. I wish I could jump again. I'm not gonna lie. But it's fine. My god, the camera is just... Killing me, bro. Okay. Car like putting in some work from range. I was gonna say, if this dude hits Gale while drunk... We have a problem. Alright, I think I may just end up going around with Will, because uh, Will is very low HP right now. Yeah, I think we just go around. I need to deal with uh, these people, so I'm just gonna spawn the Wraith on top of them from up here. Let's heal, though. Okay, we gain an extra 9 HP because of the the thing. The Dark One's Blessing. I just need to take Shadow Heart downstairs somehow. Okay. Actually, what I need to do is heal Kremiel. Oh, I can't target Under! I forgot! <laughs> How do I heal undead, by the way? <laughs> I made Kremiel undead. Which is technically okay, but at the same time I can't heal her. Which is technically not okay. How do you heal undead? 
because necrotic damage is not it. And I was hoping necrotic heals undead, but it doesn't. Yeah, I have a, pro a small problem. A small problemo. Let's heal Lazel. And I think it just jumped down next turn. It just jumped down here instead of right down there. Okay. Okay, we got a dasher. As long as these mother yuckers don't all jump me and I have advantage over them, it's all good. just named this video the fucking courtyard incident because that's what it was we failed horribly the first time okay surely you die surely I just wish I didn't have to use Gale to do it but I don't have to use Gale because I can use a Starion next turn so I'll just fireball I think yeah I'll just fireball these two so may, I'm making sure they die. Uh, why are you walking into the fucking blindness, though? Bro, just... Cast the damn spell! What do you mean, not enough movement? Holy shit! Oh my god, Gil! Motherfucker, you! What are you doing, bro? Sure, just... Kill them off, bro. Oh my god. What if I do this? Will they all three die? Please. No. Nobody died! Are you kidding me? Unlucky, bro. Did I not cast a level 3? Okay. That was sad. Actually sad. He just randomly walked into the blindness, and for some reason he can't cast from where he's at. He can't do the fireball. It's very sad how that works. Come on, Astarion. I, I want Astarion to be here. So we have multiple angles on the fight. Okay, that's what I want. No time to waste. Multiple freaking angles. Where is dude? Okay, the Booyah gets hit by Lazel's bow. What? Yo, where are you going? What the f- Hello? I don't know what that was, but guy just ran off and died. Also, this, I just, just didn't notice this guy in the back. I'm gonna have to deal with that. Random sharp eye mirg in the back. Well, at this point, I think I just take Kremiel back. Bro, let me fly all the way over there. Why can't I? It's a little bit sad, but it's fine. Okay, I'm assuming... Uh, Yo, hold up, how many actions do I got? <clears throat> I just hit three times, hold up. <clears throat> we can make an additional free attack after making an unarmed or weapon attack. If you gain the extra attack feature from more than one class, they don't add together. I just hit three times. Other creatures within 10 meters of you that can see you must succeed. Uh, we can't... Okay. I am confused. I just hit three times. And I don't know why. It's nice that I can't be blinded, by the way. That's very cool. 
Okay. Well, Kremiel deal dealt with that. I still got seven turns of Embrace of the Fallen. I need Will to summon the Shadow Spawn. Okay, I'm still taking three damage. It's cringe, but it is what it is. It's better than 19. Okay, let's go hit Sharp Eye Aggie. Bro. Bro. Four? Really? Might as well roll a three at that point. <clears throat> we got good old Crusher over here that needs... Oof. He just threw a fucking stone, bro. That did a lot of damage. Or are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> Can you stop? With the random throws. Okay, I need Shadow Spawn, like, now. Fury, Fear, Despair. Despair is nice, but I think I just go with the Fury one. And... And... I'ma do just this. Boom! We call him right up there. I'ma heal again. I was wondering why my camera just went dark. <laughs> they are kind of out of range. Okay. I need to jump, but at the same time, I need to make sure I'm not right up in Karlak's ass, if you know what I mean. Because if they AoE me, it's gonna be cringe. If I... I'm trying to hit from here, bro. Don't, don't make me move. Okay, we got a Warlock, we got the Tracker. I'm gonna hit the Tracker. It's kind of cringe that I have to... I don't really want to go down just yet. Okay, that could have been a 10. Why not just make it a 10, bro? Uh, it's fine. I got two more hours worth of recording. This, this may just be a three-hour video. With me just trying to kill the fucking goblins in the courtyard. <laughs> okay. As long as Karlak is not being halted, it's fine. And as long as the race is taking all the aggro, that's even better. Okay, I need this guy to just start hitting though. Okay, I don't mind the blindness. I do mind the good old ogre. Hey, frightened everybody in the area. Let's go. That's actually kind of cool. Now, I, I feel like I may do something. I feel like it's Gale's time. I'm, I just hope he can hit. Alright, please be able to hit. Because this could be huge. Oh, this could be huge. He is going backwards for whatever reason, but I hope he can still hit. Please cast this. Huge! Huge hit! Let's go, Gale! Actually huge. <laughs> Actually huge. Alright, surely you got advantage. No, never mind. Never mind. Hit him, though. You got 80%. It's gonna save. You don't hit that. My god. Alright, I need to hit the guy from over here next turn. But at the same time, what I want to do is kill off that stupid piece of shit of a human that was halting Karlak all the damn time. Where are you at? Where are you at? Did they run off? Because I'm not seeing them anywhere. That is weird, bro. What happened to these people? <clears throat> They're just not here. Hello? Okay, never mind. I'm gonna teleport Asterion down there. Soon. Soon. But first, I need to... No, not bone chill myself. Second wind myself. There we go. 
Uh, I need to find a way without feather fall to take no damage when I jump down. With Lazel. Other than feather fall. Okay, kill this one, please. I hate when that happens. Okay. I, I, just, I don't know, bro. It's just whenever I see critical miss, I just hate my life. I'm not even joking. Whenever I see critical miss, I just kind of hate my life a little bit. All right. If I go there, I may just insta die. Which is kind of bad. I could enshroud. And I become invisible until I move. At the same time, I don't really want to enshroud. Um, I think... I can't go all the way over there. I think I go and deal with this guy. Can I still hit, though? I think I can. Let's try Flourish. It's, it's a 98% advantage. Do I have another hit other than Flourish? No. Let's try Flourish. This puts him down, no? Off balance. Okay. That's a lot of damage. We got six more turns. Oh, there's another guy here. I forgot about the tracker. It's time we shield. There we go. Alright, now I need Karlak to jump the dude down there. We got disadvantage. I don't exactly like that. I don't have the legacy of Avernus, but I'll do the... Do I do Branding Smite? Yeah, let's not, let's not do that. I will rage. Let's rage. I can still hit, no? Oh, uh, yes. I'll try Concussive Smash. Okay, now I'm hoping it works. Because I did just leave blind. Okay. It did hit. Okay, we do tail defense. Got him. Okay. Okay. I need you to chill your ass down. Just a little bit. We got a goblin up here now, apparently. Why does this dude just randomly come at me, bro? Okay. Please just kill her off. Oh my god, Will, what the fuck? Okay, that despawned the shadow spawn. That's cringe. That's actually cringe. Oh my god, Will, you motherfucker. What are you doing? <clears throat> I need the spiritual weapon. Okay, we are not, uh, not too hot. We get additional hit points. Do I level 3 this? We are gaining additional hit points. Also an additional 1 to 8 force damage. But it does require a level 3. Yeah, let's not level 3 this. Um, let's see. I need to hold these people. I think this is... Please. Okay, never mind. It's fine, it's fine. I will hold these people. I will try to snipe this guy. Good damage. Fog cloud is a concentration. We stopped it. No! That is so bad. Will you do something, please? Okay.
Brawl. Why are you healing the crusher? Stop. <laughs> we are being fog clouded on Shadow Shadow Heart. Shadow almost called her Shadow Flame. Might as well at this point. She's gonna do AoE soon. Mm hmm. I think I just fireball. Fireball is my best friend now. See? I just let's just do this. Can I please cast this? Not enough movement. I would really like to just do this. Thank you. Nice. We're doing spikes around Gale now. What? Bro, I swear to God, wild magic is uh, cringe as hell. Alright. Please kill it. Good shit. Good shit. Now I can teleport down there. Nice. And technically, I think I got advantage on the ogre, but I may not. I may just be able to sneak attack, though. Let's not forget we got Exsanguinating Strike, which we have never used because it keeps hiding behind the fucking bar here. <laughs> and I keep forgetting I got it. Alright, Lazel, can you... I need Lazel to just kind of pick up... Uh, oh, that's a lot of spikes. Oh, he, he did. Hold up. Um. Okay, I need to pick up wheel somehow. Can I please move somehow from this spot? Oh, I can't jump. I have to move. Oh, this is so bad, bro. Okay, I'll just sit here and I'll triple jump. Up here. Or up there, if I can, from over here. Let's see. It, it may let me. I'll try next turn, if Will doesn't die until then. Important is ever easy. All right. Let's kill off the warrior Sul. Good. Good shit, good shit. Uh, what I need to do is get rid of Bugbear over here. I just realized he's alive. <laughs> Who? Oh, there's another Mother Yucker here. I did not even realize. Uh, I have an extra attack here. Not sure why it's all the way there, but sure. Decent. I lost concentration. Cringe. Very cringe. Very cringe. I may have to enshroud so I don't die, but at the same time, I don't really care for her dying right now. That said, I may lose the mark of the fallen if I die. It doesn't say that I lose it if I die, but I may. You never know. Right. We need to move Carlac. Hit him hard. Hit him again. Please kill. Damn it, man. What do you mean? Okay. I... I'm gonna push him towards blind. Please. Nice. Alright, we're going in the blind. That was a... How the f... Motherfucker, you're in the blind! How do you hit? He's in the blindness fog. How is he randomly just hitting me? Please don't fail this me... Um, Will? Don't fail me now? <laughs> Come on. Come on. Also, what is this one doing? Okay, I don't know what happened, but camera freaking out for some reason. Um. Let's see, I got a 55 on that, a 49 on that one. 
for whatever reason. I actually think I do this because I gotta get rid of this stupid blind fog. It's just pissing me off. Alright, please. Bro! What are you doing the lowest amount of damage? What do you mean? <laughs> Is this one going back to Will? Bro, stop. Bro! Oh my god, okay. That is sad, bro. Am I about to die again? Random blindness fog on Lizel. These fucking spikes are cringe. I don't want to have to revify, but I may have to revify. Where's the ogre? Oh. Oh, she... Oh! Oh, oh, that's bad. <laughs> that's actually kind of bad. <laughs> um... Let's hit this one. Make sure I kill it. We got Bugbeer there, but I don't think I care about Bugbeer right now. I really just want these people to get off of my party. Why do I not have enough space, bro? Please. Okay, do I have enough space to hit? Kinda. Alright, let's put this guy into bleed mode, please. Nice. Nice. Very cool, very cool. Can I please just... I, I need to revify. Oh my god. Oh, he's not dead, I forgot. You can only do that once they're dead. If I do this, I'm gonna take damage, but I, I have to. Can you please get him up, bro? I need Gale. I need his damage. <laughs> I actually need his damage. And I need to move outside too, but at the same time, I kind of... Will I be taking damage every single turn? I'm hoping it's not the case if I don't move. I'm hoping I can just jump down... Okay, I need to get Gale out of this stupid... Um, Let's do this. Alright. I'm gonna have to lay on hands. Gotta remember, Kremiel does have a self-heal, and I'm hoping I can actually make use of it. Uh, spiritual weapon may break my thing, because it does do a little bit of light. It, it's actually causing some light in the area. So let's not go there. I may just have to lay on hands, dude. Can I do lay on hands... No effect on undead! Uh, wait. Does this also count for myself as in the healing effect? Oh, this may be bad. This may be real bad. I can't go all the way over there. Damn it, man. Come on. Don't waste a step. Okay, I'm gonna have to... What? Anyway. I'm gonna have to do this. Good shit. Good shit. Hamstring trot? Nice. I don't think I can fly. No. Unless I dash. Alright. Let's do some dips to the ogre. Nice. Let me just move a little bit here. Alright. I need you to actually deal with the crusher. Will you die though? Thank you. Finally. Alright, there is this one random fucking goblin that just killed off Gale. Uh, not Gale, Will. Incoming. So I'm gonna have a uh, car like the. Ah! Uh, oh, I mean, it's it's done now, so. 
Let's heal once. It's gonna provoke attack of opportunity, so let's not move. I need you dead, bro, so die. Thank you. If I move, will it provoke attack of opportunity? Oh my god. Yes, it will, because this guy reaches all the way over here. Ay, ay, ay. Okay, Kremiel got Shield of Fate. Which I believe is uh, this. I don't really want this ogre to hit Shadowheart, but I don't think I got a choice. Okay, it's fine. I can't Aura Forge because I just used my action. Man. Alright, yes, you move closer to Karlak so I can hit you instantly. Why are you shoving a Asterion, bro? Why are you shoving a Asterion, bro? Bro, stop! <laughs> Sheesh! Yeah, it's needed. Definitely needed. But at the same time... Can I smack him without hitting a Asterion? No. That's a big fat no. What if Melt's Acid Arrow? If I do this, who do I hit? Only the big dude. What is this? What What is this? Okay, should be fine. It's saying path is interrupted. Uh, you know what? I need to start hitting uh, Bowie Knook here. So let me do that. I got an angle. I got a good angle. I do actually need to heal. Make sure I maintain a healthy HP pool on Gale. I I need to I need to stop concentration on this guy. That's what I need to do. Are you serious? Okay. Offhand. Got him. Sneak attack. Let's go. And I will exsanguinating strike the big guy. Let's go. Alright, I think big guy is just straight up dead now. Uh, Shade Shield. Nice. Lazel, where are you at? Um, does Lazel have a decent... Uh, I should have enough range to... Um, you know what? I'm not gonna revive him. Because he's gonna revive when I win combat. So let's not waste the Rabify. The fact that I'm stuck up here with Lazel is kind of cringe to me, but I don't really have much of a choice. Oh, please just... Let me jump, bro. I want to jump. Why is it so hard to just jump down there? Do I have an angle on nobody? How do I not have an angle from over here? Oh. Okay, that makes sense. Never mind. Uh, can I... I really just want to jump there. So let's move closer to... I'll dash, move closer. Just get me right in here so I don't have to lose all that much HP. And of course, I will just jump on you. Now I can move Karlak. I don't have to hit this one. Okay. Okay. I did waste Karlak's turn by taking her there. Where are those two people? They just buggered off somewhere. I do not see those two anywhere. That is weird. That is so weird. I'm only seeing goblins. I'm not, not seeing the two humans anywhere. Where the fuck did they just randomly disappear to? That's so weird, bro. Okay. Alright, it, it's time I... No, it's not. Never mind. Yeah. Kremiel can tank quite a lot, but movement is not her strong point. Alright, how far can I... Ah, uh, pretty far, actually, with the dash. 
Okay, Mark of the Fallen is here. That's good. I, I do need to start healing. Okay, good damage, good damage. I'm just gonna get in there. Hit him. Alright, you're dead. Finally. I don't think I need to worry about this one goblin now. It's fine. Just get hit. Will you hit back though? No? Okay. That's it, no? Alrighty then. This was... This was a whole episode, which I did not think would happen. 300? Damn! Oh my god, I got everything? <laughs> oh wait, I got everything the trader had. Oh. 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 Okay. Okay. Um, let me just read the magic weave real quick. Okay. Thieves tools. Let me click on this real quick. Let me... Get the thieves tools if I can actually click on them. Get the music box. Bro, just... Can I grab the damn thing? Okay. That was the Baldur's Gate music, right there. Okay, let's read this real quick as well. We got a crude chest. We got a bomb. I will take that. Good shit, good shit. That's a shield, but I don't think it got any special effect. No, it does not. Alright. I feel like I'm about to sneeze. Uh, I, I am about to sneeze. Hold up. Sheesh. Alright. Um, I will take most of the stuff from here with the Gale. Come on. Come on. Alright. Okay, let's see. So, we got Doomhammer. Uh, this is two-handed. I will send this to Karlak for now. Gloves of Archery. Uh, I will send this to Astarion. Boots of Aid and Comfort. I will give this to Shadowheart for now. Jump distance increased. Um, I think I give this to Karlak because Lazel has her own jump. Returning Pike is a cute one. I think I'll just give this to Kremiel. Evil Monk Clothes. What? Half Illited Armor. Why half filleted armor? Rare vanity clothing. It's shards chosen. Evil paladin. Oh, that works for Kremiel, actually. Evil paladin. Um, I'm gonna send uh, to Kremiel. Cambion. I think I sent the Cambion one to... Never mind, I do not send this to Karlak, even though... Yeah. She does not use armor. Karlak does, in fact, not use armor. I'm pretty sure. Vampire Lord clothes. I'm sending this to Astarion, because obvious. Obvious vampire. Level boosts. Armor class increases as you level up. Woodland dress. What? 
Um, your crown should deal additional damage equal to your charisma modifier. <laughs> I'm tempted to just send this to dry address. Man, I just need to grab all of this. Great Claw, Great Sword. I'll send the Great Sword to Lazel. Give the Great Club to Karlak for now. Give the War Pick to Karlak, just because she can hold a lot of stuff. Give the Longbow to Asterion. Black Mizora Boots. What? Shadow Teleportation. I think I give this to Cremiel. Your cantrips deal additional damage equal to charisma. Um, I, I kind of want to give that to, to what's it called, uh, to Will. So I will do just that. Charming Lord Jacket. Interesting. Interesting. Uh, we'll grab all of this. NPC die pack. This is a bunch of modded stuff right here. Lokelani lavish delivery? What? Um, sure. I'll send this to Crimea because she can handle a lot of weight. I don't know about all of these. I need some clothing that gives me armored class. If that's even a thing. Definitely not giving him the woodland dress. Evil monk. Sure. Uh, let's just equip. We'll see how it looks. Oh, not bad. Not bad. Actually kind of works with the hat. Hmm. Alright, I'll give the Charming Lord one to Will. I'll give him the clothing too. I'll just take the black die, the anvil. Smith tools. Supplies. There's a crude maze. We don't care about these. They're useless. I'll take this. 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 These are die. Dies. We are maybe coloring some stuff later. Die remover, sure. Gain a bonus to dexterity. Hide armor. Start to saving throw and check, gain one bonus to initiative. This is medium though. Um I'll give this to whoever. I don't even know. I think I'll just give it to Astarion for now. Let's see what else we got here. I'm not gonna take all of this. I'm not taking all of these. I may give the woodland the stuff to Shadowheart. Maybe. Maybe. Shards chosen. I will give the shards chosen to... I think. Yeah. I'll give it to Shadowheart. Sure. Give the evil monk clothes to Gale. Half illitude. Yeah, I'm not using that. Okay. I think we are fine. Alright, this trader had a bunch of stuff. A bunch of stuff. Time I actually equip, if I can. I could use some gloves. Let's see. Evil Paladin. Disadvantage on stealth sharks. And we got nothing. I do have this. 
Okay, that looks kind of cool. That looks kind of cool. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, that's not bad. But I'm not gonna use that. Black Mizora boots. I can't use this because I'm using the Leviathan claws. So I think I'm giving this to Will as well. Uh, let's see now. Piercing. This weapon will return to its owner when thrown. Oh, that's... You know what? I know this is a 1d10, but the fact that this returns to my hand when thrown is good. I got a weapon I can use from range with Kremiel without having to actually get into range myself. And it's really good because Kremiel, gotta remember, I am, because because of these Leviathan Claws, I'm walking kind of slow. I got minus 3 move speed. Minus 3 meters. Um... I don't think I need all of these. This is two-handed, but it's also... Is it versatile? Um, no. It doesn't say. It is a pike, though. Can I use shield with this? No. I just have to check. Um, let's equip this, because we can. We do have some stuff here. Spring step boots may give that to Carlac. Let's see. Uncommon gloves. We got underdog. The wearer gains advantage on melee attack rolls while surrounded by two or more foes. Um, that is decent, but I think I give this to Carlac. Actually, no. Carlac has uh, gloves already. What is this misty step? Um, I will switch this. I need the Misty Step, so I can get into melee if I have to. Spring Step Boots. Do I send this to Karlak? I think Karlak already got something, though. Yeah, she has the dash. The, the dash, when you dash, gain Wrath for two turns. What does Wrath do again? I forget. One bonus damage with melee weapons for every turn this condition has remaining. Okay. Yeah, I'll give this to Lazel. Okay. Great sword. Great axe. Nah, I'll just give Sword of Justice because of tier protection. Okay. Yeah, we give the boots to Lazel. Um, do I give Lazel spring step boots? Yeah, sure. I'll give this to Lazel. I'm not gonna give her this. Heroism does kind of make sense on Lazel, but no. Can Will use shield? I don't know, but I'll check right now. Also, Black Mizora boots. And... Charming Lord. That's kind of nice. Actually works with Will, huh? This is also light armor. Okay. Kind of nice, kind of nice. Do I use shield? Oh my god, it, it works! Okay, he gets a shield. He's got 19 AC. I did not know Will can use a shield. That's... Not bad, honestly. Not bad. It does give me two extra AC, I believe. Yes, it does. Also gaining heroism. Immune to Frightened and 5 damage hit points each turn. Wait, each turn? For 10 turns? Interesting. So I basically have healing for 10 turns, which is 50 HP. Damn! Okay. Okay. That's a good shield. Where is... Let's see now. 
what else we got over here that can be useful. Fate Breaker is good bludgeoning damage. Oh, wow. Okay. I may just use Fate Breaker, actually. Can I use this? I can. Yeah, let's just use Fate Breaker with Cremio. And I do have advantage on melee attack rolls. I can use re uh, um, uh, Returning Pike. I know I just accidentally switched to Romanian for a second there. <laughs> we give this to Karlak. So many items. Bro. What is in this? Cloak? What? Oh my god. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold up. Aria di Luna? I am scared. I'm gonna equip this. I'm, I'm gonna use this off video because I'm scared to put this on video. I don't know what it is and I can't actually... I can't actually check it because it's not showing me anything. So I am scared. Apparently this only lasts until long rest. So I'm gonna have to, to do this. So, let's send this to Gale. Let's send Absolute's aid to... I'll send this to Astarion. Astarion doesn't mind weird shit, apparently. He's not proficient in medium armor. I'll give him the vampire clothes. Does not look bad. 6 to 13. Is good damage. So let's switch the bow. We got gloves of archery, but also we had on hit. Wait, on a hit with a weapon attack, possibly inflict minus one d4 penalty to targets attack roll and saving throws. Okay, you gain proficiency with long bows and short bows. In addition, your range weapon attacks do additional two damage. Um, I believe this is better for right now, anyway. I will gl give Gloves of Power to Lazel. I will give... Uh, I need to give the Medium Armor to somebody. I think I'll just keep it here for now. I am just gonna assume that... Uh, what's his face? The Druid... Halsin joins me and I can give him the Hide Armor... And it's probably gonna be better than what he has on him currently. I'm just assuming. I'm not completely sure. Now, I will give Sharis Embrace to Kremiel. Because, yeah. I just will. So, might as well switch now. Because I think it's time for a full rest. Yeah, I will just full rest right now, so I can uh, give her the Forge Blessing. I think I need to organize this shit a little bit. Let's see. Let's organize by type. Appearance Override. Yeah, I'm not gonna touch this. Not on video. Oh, I thought this was clothing for for camp, but it's not. This is the clothing for camp. Okay. And this is how we look with the equipment on. I don't really like the, the thing. So let me send this to... I'll send this to Gale. I did say I may make Gale a bard. So I'm gonna give him this. Can you equip, please? Thank you. Yeah, he looks kind of nice with this. Okay, Saloon's Dream. What is this again? There's so much stuff. An ally you touch regains hit points, but possibly falls asleep. Hmm? 
don't like that. I mean, it's good that it heals people, but putting them asleep is not not that good. <laughs> Maybe if I am immune to sleep. I, I If I have something that makes me... Ooh, Iron Flask. Well, Granata, yes. Good old Granata. Hold me close, I. <laughs> okay, what else we got? We got a lot of stuff by killing off the goblins. I have this anvil. I have no idea how to use the anvil, I'm not gonna lie. I've never used an anvil before in this game. So, I have no idea what I'm doing with it. Okay. We equip gloves of power. We equip spring step boots. Now I need to give her an armor. In armor. Needs to be given to Karlak. You are using medium armor. What if that hide... Do I give her the hide armor? It's gonna look a little weird. It does look kind of weird on her, I'm not gonna lie. But at the same time, weirdly fitting. Is weirdly fitting. I don't know why. She does lose one AC though, so let's not do that. Okay, what else do I have that I need to make use of? I gotta make sure I am fully equipped. I got Swirezy shoes, jump, jump distance increased. I got Doom Hammer. Oh yo yo! Each strike fills the target with a chilling dread that prevents it from regaining hit points. Undead creatures also get disadvantage on attack rolls. Okay. When you miss an attack, you deal four bludgeoning damage anyway. This is two-handed. If that was not two-handed, that would have been kind of nice. I do have war pick. Mm. Can should I give this to Crimea? What is? You know what? Let's check. Let's march. I will do this. And now I need to check which one is better. 6 to 16, 2 to 6. Well, that's already way better. Yeah, let's use this. I think Doomhammer is way better. Oh, it looks way better too. Damn! Okay. I do lose the absolute power thing. Which is kind of kind of not decent. You know what? I will give Faith Breaker. Is this two-handed? It's versatile. I'm giving this to Karlak, and the next time I get a Faith Point, if I get another Safe Point, I'm just gonna do this and switch the shield off. I think I should be giving this shield to Shadow Heart. But at the same time, I kind of need the extra armor class. Uh, do I? Do I need the extra AC considering I'm perma healing on Karlak? I don't. Th I don't think I need this. I think Shadowheart needs this more. And I'm gonna give uh, Karlak another weapon soon, so... I'm gonna just do this. Yeah, that's so much better. That looks so much better. Okay, we got Boots of Aid and Comfort. When the weather heals a target, it gains an additional 3 temp hit points. Hmm... 
Hmm. I think I give this to Gale because I may turn him into a bard, like I said. Let's see. I, do I have boots on Gale? I don't. So yeah, I'll just give boots of aid and comfort to Gale. I, at this point, might as well just give him the saloon's dream. Saluna. Or rather, do I give this to Lazel? Because Lazel has dancing lights and I don't really like that one, actually. Especially since I don't need a light, because Kremiel needs shadow. Okay, we need shadows for Kremiel's abilities to work. So dancing lights is counterproductive. Very much. Also, this is another heal for everybody. Possibly falls asleep. Does not say it's guaranteed. So, let's see. I will touch myself. Hey. Nice. Okay. Nice. <laughs> Very cool. Very cool. That's another heal. We got for free on Lazel. Okay, I think it's time we slowly split the party. So. Um, first of all. I need to teleport out of here. And I will teleport to... Okay, I need... To untoggle group mode. I said... Kremiel... Oh, fudge. Okay. Okay, that was not really what I had in mind, but it's fine. Sure. Let's test this hammer. Jeez! Okay, it hits hard. <laughs> it really does hit hard. Okay. There is a chest here, so I might as well at this point. Okay. I did say I'm sending Gale there. Might as well knock the lock. Okay. And Shadow Heart. Please. Move. Did you drop your shield? I'm confused. Is it because I'm seeing camp clothing? Is there no shards chosen armor? Like actual proper armor? Or have I missed it? Vanity clothing. Random corset. Let's open this one and check. Oh, okay, yeah, there's a lot of clothing in here. Yeah, I'm not gonna touch these. Okay. There is a bunch of stuff in here that is modded content and uh, you know what, I'll just I'll just grab it and maybe look at it at another point in time I don't, again I don't think I touched these I wish this was armor it's fine okay now I need to group these people I need to group Shadowheart with Gale and uh, also need to... No, I don't actually. What am I doing? <laughs> no, I actually don't need to do that. Uh, I was gonna do something a little bit stupid. It's fine. I need to figure out a way to heal myself. <sighs> Will this even work? How do you heal undead? That is my question. Anyway, I do need this because I can Valk Valkrana Corpse Grenade. So, they are both undead. 
I am probably gonna have to end up using Valkana's Corpse Grenade onto Crimeal at some point. And just level 3 it. Okay. We are... Grouping? No. Not like this. Trying to group these three together. Okay, can I group you, th bro? Please. Oh, y'all just moving in here, huh? Okay, I need y'all to just move here. On grouping this is pain, but it's fine. Okay. Can I now please group these three people? Only these three. No. Bro, stop. They are so far away, but it's forcing me to group them. Why? How do you only group certain groups? <laughs> Does that make sense? I kind of need to just not be in this area, I feel. Come on. This way. I am so far away. It's it's so annoying. Oh, it's grouping everybody. It's so annoying, bro. Okay, y'all just enter back into the stronghold. Because you're starting to piss me off a little bit. Okay, surely now I can group them. Surely now. It's still grouping everybody except Gale. Okay. Okay, they're not all grouped. Okay. Good. And now I can do this. Thank God, bro! We got three sep uh, two separate groups now. So. Kremiel, Shadowheart, and Gale will go back to Grove. While Lazel and the other group will go... Towards the Githyanki. I need to find a teleporter. Okay. Let's go to... Roadside cliffs, I guess. Roadside cliffs. Good. And now I hope I can see a teleporter closer to the Gits. Um, that's a negative. Actually, the goblin camp might just be the closest. Let's teleport to goblin camp. Okay. Oh, it's right here. That is... I am back here. <laughs> anyway, I have grouped them, which is what I intended to do. There's a lot of food here. Might as well take it. Because we do plan on long resting quite a bit through this playthrough, probably. I wish I didn't have to move all the damn time just to take these. Come on, come on. It's so time consuming just taking some food, bro. Give me that. Let me go read this because I have not. Okay. Do you have anything for me? No. For for some random dude that was kind of strong, you had nothing, really? Alright, now if I recall... Ah. Here you are! Here you are! Okay. I think I just... Ah. Oh, it's shadow teleportation. You know what? This actually kind of works with Kremiel, but unfortunately it's on the boots. It's fine. He does have shadow spawn and darkness, so... It does still kind of work with, uh... With, uh, Will. 
I need to get rid of Brina. Brina is annoying. Thank God I found her because she is the most annoying piece of garbage I have found recently. Can I please hit? It's fine. I'll, I'll just hit Andrik first. It's fine. It's fine. Alright, Karlak. Get in there. I'm definitely hitting Brina though. Um. Oh wait, I don't have the. Oh, that was on the great sword, wasn't it? The swipe, the, the cleave. Yeah. All right. Now Stadion can almost jump there. Let's see. I need about three meters, I think. Never mind. I can sneak attack this, so I'll just do this. Of course, we miss. Cringe. That is also kind of cringe. See, this... This one human here is the most annoying piece of garbage I've ever seen. Why are you such a pain for no goddamn reason? Just... Take the L. Taste my fury. Okay, good. We smack him. Please don't have any AoE. Good. Now, what I don't exactly know, but I am assuming works... Uh, ooh, come on, heavy armor. Um, I'm gonna send this to Kremiel, because... Uh, she's supposed to be using heavy armor, but that's not how I'm playing her. Also, I don't think I'm proficient in heavy armor with Kremiel. Do I have any heavy armor proficiency in my group? I don't think I do. I have not taken it. This be good. I have not taken it. Alright. Um, what we need. <sighs> Will this teleport everybody though? I'm pretty sure this is gonna teleport everybody. So I'm gonna have to start using teleport party. Uh, okay. Can you make everybody jump? No. I'll just use the ladder, old-fashioned way it is. Yeah. See, remember I told you this is gonna be a long episode? Yeah. Yeah. We're going the long way. We are splitting the group. We are actually taking one long episode. To basically kind of shorter the time we are taking in Act 1. Because I'm gonna be kind of blitzing through this now. If I'm doing the split, I feel. Okay, was this the way? Um. No. My god. Um. Okay. I found the teleport. Never mind. <laughs> Alright. I need Lazel here, but at the same time I think Will's gonna be the main the main uh, protagonist of this group. We are going this way, towards the gates. Towards the mountain pass. I wish I could just click on the map like this. And my characters would just go there. But it doesn't work. You unfortunately cannot be... Just... A strategist in that way. If you know what I mean. I was trying to just... Make it go faster. Like click on the map so they go there. While I click on the other people. But what I can do... Ooh, that Garavan agent... I don't remember if I actually clicked on that one. So let's do that right now. 
Gotta keep in mind, I do have a Starion in this group. Hmm, I did not click on him. Alright. Shipment orders. Let's uh, read. Um, read the first sentence again. This will happen if you open the chest. What chest, bro? I don't remember. Have I read all these? Okay, you know what? I'll just read one and move on. A circular from the Church of Ogma, Lord of all knowledge. It is stamped with the seal of Brever... Brevik, Most High, Lord Master of the Unrolling Scroll Temple in Baldur's Gate. Okay, this may actually be useful. Hold up. Ah... Yeah, I'll just touch these real quick, because they may prove to be useful. The gate is closed. Hmm. Can I please read these? Okay, I'm gonna have to grab this before I read it. Uh, Bastion of Commerce and Culture, Corruption and Catastrophe, Baldur's Gate. Interesting, interesting. And I don't recall if I've read this, but maybe I have, okay. Let's drop it. Alright, moving on. Um, I know I said I'm going to the Underdark, but do I want to go to the Underdark right now? Dilemma, dilemma. Do I want to go right now to the Underdark? Okay, I have read that one. Because there is a place where I have never been, which is the Sunlit Wetlands down here. I've never been there. Do I want to go to Underdark right now? Probably no. Okay, we are taking them to the Gits. Or closer to the gates, rather. Waypoint discovered. Where? Motherfucker, I was here before and I and you're telling me I did not have that one? I was here before. Why did I not have it? That is so weird to me. Can I pump some water? Um, yes, question mark? Alright, I will click there. And now with this group, we are moving to Emerald Grove. Let's talk to Halsin. Well, we need to find Halsin first. Did guy wake up? Um, he's not here anymore. Where is Halsin? Where is Halsin? Where is Halsin? Speak to Zevlor. Let's do that. Where is Halsin? I'm confused just a little bit. Let's see if Zevlor got anything good to say. I'm assuming we saved everybody. Because we did just kill off all the goblins. Okay, so they're still going to Baldur's Gate? They are all grouped here. Where is Zevlor? Where are you at, my guy? Oh, he's on the gate? Oh, he's up there. Okay. So he's above the gates. A scout just reported. The goblin's leadership has been decimated. Yes. We might escape this place yet. And I hear you are the one to thank. I'm grateful. I took a collection from all of us. It isn't much, but you've earned it. Alright. So. The main story is gonna follow Kremiel. We got a side story with Lazel and Will and Asterion plus Karlak. Which are going towards the Gizyanki. And I think we're going to the Underdark and deal with the Night Song. With Kremiel and taking Shadowheart and Gale with us. Yeah. Alright. It's not enough. 
but it's all we have. Hao Sin will likely want to thank you too, mind. He returned just a while ago. Okay. I believe he's catching up. Ooh, nice eyes, bro. As for us. I'm seeing some flickering flames in the inside there. Amazing. We can finally leave. But perhaps we need not speak of farewells. We'll join your camp tonight to celebrate if you'll have us. Hey. Uh, if we go there right away, Halston may just be there. So let's do that. Excellent. Lead the way. All right. Um, everybody in camp. Okay, so if I go to camp, everybody just follows. It doesn't matter if we are split in groups or not. That said, we do still maintain our split groups, so that's cool. That's kind of nice. Alright, we... First of all, need to talk to Astarion. He's got something to say. You know, I never pictured myself as a hero. Never thought I'd be the one they'd toast for saving so many lives. And now that I'm here... <laughs> this is awful. And here I thought Astarion just uh, had a wholesome moment, but he's like, nah, fuck this bullshit. <laughs> really? He's not that bad. Think of all the goblins you killed. True. <laughs> that was fun. Yeah. I would have liked more for my trouble than a pat on the head and vinegar for wine. Expecting rewards? Hmm. The goblins would have thrown a wilder party. What if I take the bottle and just try the wine? Let's do that. <laughs> it's a heavy, rich red. Dry and sharp. See what I mean? Awful. Okay. All I want is a little fun. Is that so much to ask? Hmm. <clears throat> it's going to sound weird, but I kind of fuck with Asterion's vibe. <laughs> okay. Goblin hunt? Asterion rejected, Goblin Hunt, Asterion rejected, Goblin Hunt, Asterion rejected. What? I am confused. What does Goblin Hunt, Asterion rejected mean? Um, let's just go with option 4, because I don't know what the Goblin Hunt Asterion Rejected means. So just go option 4. Don't be so sour. I like a good time as much as anyone. You know, we could always make our own entertainment, darling. Get a little closer. So to speak. Oh, he's taking the initiative. Interesting. Mm, maybe if you say please? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> My guy be like, what? Goblin hunt Asterion partner. Goblin hunt has partner. What? Ooh, Asterion plus five or minus one. I am so confused. What the f fuck do these mean, bro? <laughs> um, confusion? Nah, it's not happening. Oh, he, he, he also approves, but also disapproves at the same time. You know what? It's, it's a plus five and a minus one, so it's a plus four. I'll take it. <laughs> I'll take it. I'll take the plus four without having to fuck a starry on on YouTube, okay? I'm sorry, but I don't know what's gonna happen, so... I don't really want a scene. Okay. And we got good old Halcyon over here, but... At the same time, do we have to talk to anybody else? Have I redeemed myself, though? Or am I still an Oathbreaker? Okay, I'm still an Oathbreaker. Not sure how I redeem myself, I'm not gonna lie. Wheel is there. I don't wanna spend like a thousand gold to redeem myself, so I'll keep going as I am. I believe it's working so far. Shadowheart got nothing to say. 
Okay. So aside from... Uh, Volo has a shop? Let's see what Volo's got. I do hope you have partaken of something bracing. This may well take us all night. Let me move the mouse because it's a little bit distracting. Hmm. Shouldn't we be celebrating? But I am engaged in celebration of the purest form. Commemoration. Commemoration. If we are to write your legend in the stars. Then we must first give you a name. Motherfucker, we got a name. We called Kremiel the Fallen Angel. A frame without its crowning jewel. Your nom de guerre. My nickname? Fallen Angel. <laughs> but not How about Oathbreaker? We don't want to exclude the common folk after all. I intend this tale to enrapture all. Alright, do I get to choose a nickname or something? Grovekeeper Goblin's Bane? Um, I already have a name. A wonderful one indeed. But your deeds loom larger than life now, my friend. You simply must have a title to match. May I choose my own? How about not Goblin's Bane or Grovekeeper? Volothamp Gedarm? What? <laughs> you got something in mind? Now, Goblin's Bane do actually does kind of sound nice, but Goblin's Bane is not how I want Kremiel to be remembered within the story. I wish I could just choose my own. Just make up my own. Far too much. This is the very problem. If you could set aside your many triumphs, carry out one defining act, not to belittle your achievements to date, of course, but besting a dragon, a giant, a god, perhaps? Ah, I see. So we wait. Enjoy your evening. I shall have work for you in the days to come. Mm-hmm. So he's gonna just be a, a guy that's writing our history, kind of. Or story, rather. All right. So if I come back at the later date, I may be known as... Kremiel Fucker of Absolute, if you know what I mean. <laughs> we are smacking a god. Let's... let's Engage in a conversation with the druid. Hopefully he joins us. Hopefully he joins us. Let's we'll see. Uh, let's not have sexy time with the bear. Go on, mingle a little. Later, perhaps. No. Right under the stars amidst nature's creation. All right, but will you come with me? I kind of need you. Kind of need an extra. Go on, enjoy yourself. Seek out some wine before it runs dry. There are a lot of thirsty people. Uh, bear in mind, I don't exactly know if Halzin or Mintara join us. I've never actually had any of them in the party with me. So, yeah. Um... Did I not just talk with Halfen? Enjoy yourself tonight. I'll come and find you in the Oh, he coming in the morning. All right. Yeah, I think we just end the night. Yeah, let's just long rest. End the night. We don't care about anything right now other than just doing that. As you approach your bunk, you've picked up a few pleasant memories on your journey amongst your struggles. Okay. I need to figure out a name for this episode because uh, what I had in mind was the courtyard incident, but actually that may still work. Hmm. Let's go to bed. You sleep alone, uplifted by memories of your recent triumphs. We fucked him up. <laughs> hey, my claws are finally gone off screen. They, they don't float above me anymore. Alright, so your companions remain deep in dreamful sleep and can't awaken yet. Um, Will is here. Uh, your armor squirms against your body, ready to evolve. It struggles, though. 
Seemingly not having enough energy to do so. Perhaps you need to sate it more before resting? You wake up feeling that your body has subtly changed. Your muscles feel softer and your, your flesh feels fuller in certain places. What? Leviathan? <laughs> I'm assuming. It's extremely perilous, though it seems you're well accustomed to navigating danger. What's so dangerous about it? Mm -hmm. mm, how about you join me, though? Hmm. That's it? Just go to this place? What were you expecting? That I'd mumble a spell or whip out a potion. I was expecting you to join me. Well, just because you're naive enough to expect easy answers. Now, allow me to continue. To get to the towers, you'll need to pass through a terrible place. A cursed place. This curse shrouds everything in shadow. Ah. You will not find life, light, or anything natural there. I do remember a cursed place. Twisted by the curse, they become shadow beings. Tormented, dangerous souls. Okay, I, I do remember a cursed place because I have been at its doorstep before, but I will not talk about it until we actually get there. Also, I found that one through the Underdark, which I'm pretty sure is not exactly the place to go through, but it's fine. I'll do that again anyway. Any who linger are twisted by the curse. Okay, we don't care. So, like, I have no choice. I need to find a way through. What do you suggest? The absolute forces can't already the place. How are you so sure Moonrise is where I gotta go? Nature speaks to me. Birds report what they've seen. And I've overheard goblins speaking of it, too. Moonrise is at the heart of all this. I'm sure of it. So I'm pretty sure you're just bullshitting yourself and you just heard goblins. <laughs> anyway. Um Absolute forces can tolerate the place? That's kinda interesting. You'll have to choose your approach carefully. You could go overland. Along the risen road or through the mountains. Easier at first, but you'll run into the shadow curse eventually. So Hey, there, there we go. In the of Saluna. It leads to Moonrise Towers through the Underdark. Alright. A man called Ketherick Thorne built a secret stronghold deep down there before rallying a whole army of Dark Justicius, Shah worshippers. Dark Justicius? I must see for myself. Aridan and his lot were looking for a way to... Oh, this makes so much sense for the story. ...riches if they retrieved a relic called the Night Song. But I think there's more. From this stronghold, Ketherick's forces could access both the Temple of Saluna and Moonrise Towers. But he was defeated before he could launch an attack. If you can find this place, I'll wager it will reveal a more direct path to Moonrise Towers. And maybe even bypass the worst of the Shadow Curse. Okay, this, this is gonna make so much sense for the split that I'm doing because... Gale needs constant assistance by the main character, as in us. Because he just needs to be fed magic all the damn time through items. And Shadowheart just literally said she wants to go, because she wants to see the Dark Justicers. Also, Lazel wants to go to the Githyanki. Karlak has no reason to go downstairs, if you know what I mean. I don't think Astarion has a reason either, because he's just planning to go to Baldur's Gate, so he's just gonna probably follow Lazel. And again, Will has no reason to be in the Underdark either, I believe. So, um, yeah. I never thought I'd say this, but I, it sounds like the Underdark is the safer route. Anything is preferable to risking. Also, Shadow Hearth wants it, so. I'd like to join your camp, if you'll allow me. Of my course. Skills, my counsel. You're gonna join more than my camp. You're gonna join my party. It seems our fates have aligned. All right. So the plan. 
Lazel and the other group will go towards Moonrise Tower if we don't just get wiped. Uh, through the mountains, because if you recall, we found a mountain pass last time we fought with the Gits. And it told us that we are much too low level. That was behind the stronghold of the goblins. Yeah. So we're gonna have to go through there. We're gonna have to go through there probably anyway. Just to find the gits again. So yeah. Um. On the flip side, I'm gonna take Halston with us. Because he does want to go to Moonrise Tower. And it makes very much sense for him to be with this group. Specifically. Alright, let's go then. I don't care about the Grove. Fuck the Grove. <laughs> I just want Holson at this point. Alright. Um, let's go touch Holson real quick. Where are you at? Something's on my mind. Oh? Stimulation surge? Uh, my outfit just changed. Ah, oh, we prepared for battle. I forgot. We are a sadomasochist with this. Yeah, basically. What? Okay. Um. How how do you know so much about the parasite? I studied one of. I'm not gonna flirt with the uh, Halson. Uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> A drow attacked me, and I defended myself. Afterwards. I was able to examine the tadpole that emerged. Hideous, but fascinating. Like nothing else in nature, I'm glad to say. Uh, if you're expecting me to flirt with the characters, please drop this expectation. I'm mostly here for the story, not for the flirting part of the game, okay? I'm mostly here for the story and for Kremio's story at this point, okay? I'm not really here to romance anybody, but if it's gonna be somebody, it's probably gonna be Shadowheart just because she's the one with the artifact. Um, are you faring out at camp? Because that actually makes sense. If I'm honest, the grove was too comfortable for my tastes. I felt removed from nature. I'll miss my books, but I can find all the wisdom they contain out here firsthand. Nice, nice. Uh, okay, I just got three things that it's saying flirted. I'll find plenty of books. Uh, celebration before I came over to Strong, perhaps. No, I didn't. Because I told him to go mingle. <laughs> as not something I would view as coming over too strong. Or rather, coming over too strong. If there's anything I can do to make you less comfortable, let me know. No. If I play the books before long, so. okay. <laughs> well, nature does abhor waste. Let's just have normal conversations that make sense, okay? I time in your company would prove fruitful. Interesting. Can I move on, please? Oh, I just, I can literally just click leave. <laughs> My bad. Can I take you with me, though? Um, confusion, question mark? Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Can I get an eight, though? I have stimulation surge now. Available in combat, you let the tentacles freely roam over your body, heightening your senses temporarily. You recover an action, but are brought closer to overstimulation. Okay. We do recover an action, though. Where is my... Stuff. Oh, I lost cleave. Because previously... Uh, oh, I have Misty Step. That's cool. I forgot about it. Alright. Now we are fully equipped... With the... The bondage suit. <laughs> we are fully equipped with the bondage suit. I'm expecting to get some gloves at some point as well. Maybe a weapon? I don't know, but... Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna try again to take Halsin. Why do you want to go to Moonrise Tower? The creatures threaten the natural order. It's my duty to do what I can to stop them. Just join me, bro. So the 
Shadow Curse. It's an affront and must be cleansed. I helped overthrow Ketherick Thormund his Dark Justicius years ago, but I failed to prevent him from unleashing darkness across the region before he was defeated. If I can join you and get close to Moonrise, perhaps I can lift this curse just as you find a cure for your infection. Alright, you mind actually joining the party though? Um... Is that why you went with Aradin? You thought he might find this route to Moonrise? Precisely. Then perhaps I could have done something about both the Shadow Curse and Seramorphosis aberrations. But in my eagerness, I put far too much faith in the abilities of Aradin and his band. We didn't even get close. Okay. Is there a way to actually get him to join the group? As in not only the camp, but come with me to fight, bro. Seems like you feel responsible for the Shadow Curse somehow. Well, there's hardly anyone left to share the responsibility with. Few who witnessed the fall of Moonrise still draw breath. What Ketherick Thorm unleashed is not something that nature can undo by itself. I must do what I can. I studied the Shadow Curse for years, but to truly understand it and stop it, I must reach its source. Do you know how the Shadow Curse can be stopped? Perhaps. But we'll need to get close. Also, should I care? I am one with the shadows, if you know what I mean. From your mind for now. Once we near the curse, then there will be more to be said. Mm, how will the grove fare without you? I don't technically care about the grove, but still. I've chosen a successor as first druid. Bro, just join me! <laughs> Come on. I sent a bird to summon her. Give me an option. I'll trust your judgment. I don't care. If only everyone said that. Honestly. The grove needs to move beyond the mistakes of the past. What it needs is an unknown quantity. An outsider who can enforce the Oak Father's teachings without bias. This is why I chose Francesca. She will restore simplicity and purity to the grove in my absence. Bro, honestly, probably anybody is better than fucking Korga. <laughs> Sounds like the Grove will be in good hands. Indeed. Won't you miss being first druid? Miss it? <laughs> oh dear no. It's a terrible burden. Takes you away from nature and forces you to deal with others. That was such a bad camera angle. Be wary of anyone who actually wants such a role, I say. Likely they don't understand it, or they have ill intent. I'm just glad to be out here amidst the Oak Father's creations. Alright, so I can't actually make him come into combat, apparently. At least not right now. Let's see if I got any actions with anybody else. Shadowheart, no. Harlock, no. Asterion, we just talked. Doggy wants nothing from us. Gale's good. Will's good. Lazel seems to be good. I'm not seeing Lazel though. Where, where are you at? Oh, there we go. Alright. Well. I think... That is it for this episode. We are almost three hours in. I hope you guys enjoyed the... Courtyard incident. And I will see you guys in the next episode where... Kremiel, Shadowheart and Gale will be... Jumping towards their death to basically revive in the Underdark. That's what I plan on doing. I'll see you next time.